I, I'm a, a, a young radiology trainee. I, I mean, I am a resident. Uh, before the fellowship, I had uh, no idea about uh, MSK MRIs. I started from scratch. My way of doing the, the fellowship was uh, uh, I tried to watch every day a live Q&A call from the past. The other were, were some uh, cases I posted on the platform. I received the feed, feedback from, uh, especially from Chris, who is incredible teacher. I'm on his frequency. Uh, he's very uh, keen to, to look for details, but also not to overstate something. He's down to earth and uh, also very, very clear. Chris's explanations throughout the, the whole video, his uh, way of, uh, of teaching the other fellows uh, and uh, keeping, uh, keeping rather simple, many, many questions from the other, from the fellows. One of his important uh, way of uh, teaching is that you have to search uh, and you have to find proofs in literature. That, that helped me a lot. After some uh, months, I tried to <clears throat> get in hospitals, uh, some M MSK MRIs to report at first uh, knee cases. And I, I think now I'm pretty confident in reporting uh, knee cases. I started, I'm in the fourth year of uh, residency. I don't have the opportunity daily to, to work on MSK, but I also, I'm collaborating with some other doctors in MSK MRI. They are, uh, how do they, happy with my uh, my reports in me, and now I, I convinced them that I can take also other joints after I will finish the residence in two years from, from now on. Uh, I would like to specialize. I'm on the good, uh, good path here in, in my town. There are not many opportunities to report MSK MRIs in the, in the state uh, facility, only in private. That's why I started the, the fellowship. I see from the other colleagues that uh, they are struggling, they are reading uh, books and things, you know, in, as Chris said, uh, in books, um, you find the obvious pathology, the obvious findings, but in real life cases, it's not like this. I'm not scared anymore. Uh, when I opened an, an MRI, I really didn't uh, know what to look for. Now, as Chris explained, you, if you know uh, the anatomy, you can, uh, discriminate things because um, you eliminate things. I feel uh, more confident. The, the structure reporting, I'm not uh, getting lost and confused. For me, it works the, the, the checklist. Otherwise, I forget things uh, to look for. So structured, uh, structured reportings are the, the best way. Uh, it changed my, my way of thinking from the very beginning. It's like... Uh, uh, building habits to a to a newborn kid. If you if you want this, you have to be um, determined. It's not easy to make time in your daily schedule to see uh, those videos. It's tough. I have a, a funny way of telling to the others, where did you learn MSK? So I said, yeah, well, on the platform at school and with, with Chris and yeah, but when do you have time? I, I don't uh, drive anymore in the city from and to the hospital. And I'm watching uh, in the tram and in the in the bus. I'm with my headphones. So I, in the morning and then uh, in the afternoon, I'm watching. So it's like a habit you know, because Chris said, uh, build a habit. I'm doing the fellowship in the tram. Maybe I'm not crazy, but it's my way. If I pay this and if I want, I want this, I have to. To make more time, you know, I, I got my more busy because the uh, doctor uh, saw that I like uh, knees, for example, and uh, uh, she gave me more and more. And now she needs me in a way. <laughs> she asked me, okay, so I have uh, uh, this week uh, 10 knee MRI. Do you want to do you have time to, to report them? Yeah, I don't want to, to sound too proud. I don't know. What kind of fellows are uh, are now uh, joining? At the very beginning, really, I didn't uh, understand why they joined because uh, they were very skilled. Their questions were for me like uh, science fiction. No, <laughs> so uh, for less experienced, less confident fellows, I think uh, this is a, a great uh, way of learning.